Okay. You're not going to believe this. I've lost a day. I don't know where it went to. Um, I was supposed to have somebody look at my generator in Quartzside. So he, call, he said he'd call me on Friday, but he called me just a little bit ago, and I called him back. And he said, I asked him about tomorrow, and he said, well, we're not in on Saturday. And I said, well, tomorrow's Friday, isn't it? And he said, no, tomorrow's Saturday. I have lost one complete day, people. That's what you do when you're out here in the boondocks camping. Days come and go, and most of them you can't keep track. I can't keep track of the days. I can't, I can hardly keep track of the months. Is it me? Or is it retirement? You just don't care what day it is. That might be it. So anyway, I told him thanks for calling me back. But, no. I can't hang around for three days to get that generator fixed. And besides, I was just thinking, uh, when I was coming out here, I never used a generator on my way out. Hopefully, I can park somewhere to use my solar panel and I won't need a generator on the way back home. So, anyways, this has turned into like, I don't know what. But anyway, hopefully I'll keep you updated even though it won't be in the right time frame. <laughs> you have to listen to all my rants and raves and problems and troubles out on the road. But I never, but remember, there's always troubles out on the road. I don't care if you're home, you're on the road, where you're at, things happen. And you just have to go with the flow. You know what I say? Put a little lipstick on, you'll feel better. That's my story. This is mine and Zoe's little home here. Here we are inside, and she's walling around on the bed. There's my sink, and I don't have an earnest in here. There's my fantastic fan, my air conditioner, and that's how we live when we're out on in the road in Ruby's Roadhouse now. I have this side table set up as a couch. It's because I can put more stuff on it. I leave the bathroom door open. Oh, I just threw it way out. I leave the bathroom door open so Zoe can go in there and use the bathroom. That's where her pity pat's at. She uses it at night. She's such a good puppy, aren't you, sweetie? You're such a good dog. Yes, she is. Oh, she just loves the lay out in the sand and then come and wall it all off on the bed. Yeah. Anyway, that's a dog life. Stop life in the desert. Life in the desert. Life in the desert. Life in the desert. Okay, we're here with Maxine. She's Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> 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 She's getting ready to go back to California. Uh, she has a job there waiting on her. And I'm getting ready to uh, head east to Florida. So we wanted to say goodbye to each other. So we goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> so we meet again. Happy yeah. trail. <laughs> yeah. To so you. there you go. Um, until we meet again. Okay. Well, we all look good, don't we now? Yeah. And uh, <laughs> yeah. So. Bye-bye. Bye. Have a good one, everybody. And we'll see you soon. On my way to Buckeye. I am thinking now this is Saturday. I doubt the banks will even be open today. I just want to stop in and try to get a temporary visa card. Um, but we'll see. It's Ramona Ruby. Uh, I'm here at a pilot truck stop in probably 55, 50 miles east of Tucson. Uh, Susan and I finally met up here and um, she went to the pilot, well she went to the Flying J across the street because that's who I said I'm at Flying J when actually I was at pilot. But anyway, this is uh, really a nice place because we're at the very end where there's no trucks and um, we're okay. We're okay. And we're moving right along, so this is our, along the road, our trip from Ehrenberg to Jupiter. And this is just one 
camping spot along the way. So uh, keep on guys watching the trip. We might find something interesting along the way. And by the way, yes, the bank was closed today. I did not get my card.